by Elliot Shaw Parks, NJ Advance Media for NJ.com Although many like to mock the hype around the release of the NFL's 2018 schedule, the reality is that the mere order of the team's games can impact how their ends, a poorly placed bye week, a string of tough opponents, a long stretch on the road, for some teams. That can be the difference between a spot in the playoffs and a spot on the couch watching come January. Here is a close look at the Eagles' 2018 schedule, and some thoughts on whether it broke their way or not. Carson Wentz Michael Perez, app photo the opponents looks tough every year, a schedule looks different in January than it does in April, but a look at the Eagles schedule makes one thing very clear, this team is going to face some quality opponents in 2018, take a look at current NFC power rankings, and the Minnesota Vikings, New Orleans Saints and Los Angeles Rams are likely the three teams trailing the Eagles. This, the Eagles face all three of them, and two of those games come on the road. In addition to some of the top teams in the NFC, the Eagles also have to face the Atlanta Falcons, Carolina Panthers and Tennessee Titans, all teams that made the playoffs last. Eagles are a primetime team. Any defending Super Bowl champion is going to get their fair share of primetime matchups. The Eagles, however, are clearly one of the most marketable teams in the NFL, and for good reason, the Eagles ended up with six primetime spots, including their trip overseas to London. The NFL's confidence in putting the Eagles in prime time, especially late in the shows they expect this team to once again be competing for the top spot in the NFC and be Super Bowl contenders from Week 1 to Week 17. It also would NT be surprising if the Eagles ended up being flexed into more prime time matchups as the goes on. Eagles should be thankful to skip Vikings in Week 1. Many expected the Eagles to open up beyond Thursday night against the Minnesota Vikings. When the schedule was released, however, it was revealed that it would be the Atlanta Falcons in Week 1 coming to Philadelphia, not Minnesota, a matchup the Eagles should be thankful for. The Vikings have one of the best defenses in the NFL, and even though they aren't a good on the road, they are still not a unit that quarterback Carson Wentz, assuming he plays in Week 1, would want to play against in his first action since tearing his ACL, closing versus Washington another luck draw for the Eagles playing the Washington Redskins in Week 17. The Redskins have just one winning over the last five years, and now that quarterback Kirk Cousins is gone, it is unlikely Alex Smith is going to turn things around single-handedly. If the Eagles need a win in Week 17, even though it is on the road, they should be able to get it in the matchup against Washington.